This is KNEB.TV weather from the KNEB Storm Center, your trusted source for weather. All quiet across the area tonight. We are going to see some clouds. Can't rule out a shower, but mostly cloudy skies as we start tomorrow morning. We'll be down in the 30s, quickly warming tomorrow, and we're going to see a bit warmer conditions tomorrow. And then Sunday, Monday, that's the pick of the weekend, certainly. Sunday and then into Monday, very nice weather conditions. A cooler, rainy day on Tuesday, but all in all, the bottom line is we have a much nicer seven day forecast coming our way. Hit 63, almost normal yesterday. Uh, it's been a while since we've been able to say that. 90 is your record high for yesterday. Nothing in the rain gauge and we're tumbling uh, below normal, eating up some of that uh, um, surplus that we had going into the month. Well, here is uh, where we sit in terms of above normal, uh, high temperatures that we actually had. The higher on the scale, that's more above normal, the lower, well below normal temperatures. And as you can see, clear back uh, two weeks ago, we had a day that was in the 70s. And then we dove down here in multiple days here in a row in the 30s, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday last week. We tried to climb back to normal by Sunday and then only to fall back down again. Got about back to normal yesterday, below normal again today. But we're going to trend for a couple of days and get us back up on the other side of this. Uh, if you remember, they're going into Easter. There were several days in a row that we had very nice weather conditions. So this is where we sit now. Uh, going to dig ourselves out of this uh, below normal pattern that we've been in for a couple of weeks. We have 60s here across the area right now, 50s and 60s in our area, 64 in Norfolk, 63 in Hastings, 42 in uh, Laramie, 43 up in Casper. As we look across the area, here's a 64 in Ogallala and uh, a little cooler, some 50s. Uh, in our area, 52 in Kimball, over to 45 here, Cheyenne, and 46 up in Wheatland. Lust checks in at 43. A small sliver there of some wind gusts. Uh, generally speaking, though, we're in that 5 to 15 mile an hour forecast. No bus stop tomorrow. We're <laughs> not heading to school, hopefully, tomorrow. A few showers, that's about it. Otherwise, we're going to be mainly cloudy out here tonight. And lows overnight going to fall down into the 20s. Again, a few uh, areas may not fall below 30, but... Most of us in the 20s. Ignore that, Wheatland. Not sure what's going on with that particular reading there. For tomorrow, then, we're going to be dealing with sunshine throughout the day. Uh, tomorrow, a good deal of sun and some overcast skies then work in through the afternoon and evening hours. And we're going to stay more clouds than sun, I think, tomorrow. Finally, by Sunday, we're going to bring in some much milder air. And Sunday and Monday look very nice here across the region. Highest tomorrow, 50s and 60s. Look at these colder temps off to the north of us, though. Uh, it's going to be a little cooler there in those areas. Over the next uh, 36 hours, not much in the way of precip and certainly not much in the way of snow coming to our area. Everything is going to be fairly quiet and benign. 31 cloudy early, clearing after midnight, down to 31 tonight for a low. Tomorrow, 66 with more clouds than sun, finally trending on a warmer streak. We'll be in the mid-70s on Sunday. Monday, we continue into the mid 70s, then cooler conditions for Tuesday with a chance of some showers only to rebound back into the 60s and 70s for the middle portions and late portions of next week. Finally, looks like spring may be going to arrive here across the area.